Scream that you hate me when I know you don't It's okay, I fucked up so much I'm still surprised you don't What's your plan? To love me forever like you promised in 11th grade And never break that promise even though I didn't hesitate I owe you a rose for every breath you take What's up, what's good CC Nation? Welcome back to my channel So today we have a cooking session and what are we making? Today we're making lamp lion chops And we're gonna use a pan, no oven needed This is a quick, easy, cost efficient recipe So let's get to it So to begin with, you need to rinse your lamb chops, lamb lion chops, and then first you need to marinate them. So first I'm going to start with the spice. You can either use this spice or the rosemary, the normal one, or the fresh one. And then you're also going to need a little bit of butter. So here it is, and we have to close it and mix it well. So you put butter into your large pan. So now you put in your butter. You choose what type of butter you want to use, but I am using garlic and herb butter. Butter with garlic and herbs because I don't want to put more garlic than this is. So we're going to warm up our pan. Once your butter has melted you know, all over your pan, you can add your lamp lion chops. And then leave them like this for five minutes for them to fry on the side and turn them around. Now you can turn it around and it should be brown like this on the other side. And the blood should be coming out slowly but slowly. Then you're going to leave it for another 5 minutes on the other side. So now as you take a look, you can see that the blood is coming out. Let's give it A, B. And now we want to turn it around again. And then also add a little bit of butter. As you turn it around, you see that the color is getting better. So now we're going to put in a little bit of butter. And then we're going to close it. So here's the butter going in, not too much. And now it is recommended for us to put butter with the leaves. And close. close the pot and still leave it at a high heat. So nine. And here it is. Once your butter has melted, you can decrease the heat. So thank you. And you leave it closed. Now you want to open it and turn it around. Mm -hmm. 
very careful of the pants, huh? And then leave it for some time and close it and increase the heat. So from three to seven. So 10 minutes later, we can check it again. And show you this. So now what you want to do is add a little bit of the recipe of the ingredients that we didn't use earlier. So, To mix it, be very careful that it doesn't splash, and make sure you're wearing your apron. So now you have some sauce. And add some more. There we go. So here it is, it is ready. And you can try out this recipe with rice, couscous, mashed potato, anything quasitly. And you can add onions. And what I'm gonna do lastly is also add fresh rosemary to bring out the cream color, which is gonna make our dish beautiful. Okay, so now I'm putting in my fresh rosemary. This helps with the taste, the color, and the aroma. So we need to shove We dish it all up. It is edible. I actually chose the wrong part to this. So here it is, our juicy lion, lion chops. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Share it with friends and family. See you next time.